Uh, I did make some changes like the last, I'd say, 18 months where I just made it like just more compact and just like just more like out of my chest and I'm just going to like allow it to just like let it fly from here versus being too big and not have too many things maybe go wrong because mm -hmm. that's what I do on my back and it's like just a very simple sort of motion. So just simplifying that, that process. Um, and just honestly kind of accepting that it's just kind of going to be bad sometimes. I think there's very few people in the world who can adapt to conditions so well, like, you know, the best guys, like Novak or something. So there's going to be weeks where, unfortunately, it's just not going to be very effective. And, and there's not a, maybe a lot I can do you know what I mean? But there's going to be weeks where it's just maybe the condition. People don't think about that much. Like yeah. That often, you know, like you, you play in a condition that's probably not ideal for you. You have a bad yeah. result and then you think, oh, shit, I need to fix this. I need to fix, fix why. You don't have to fix anything. You don't have to fix anything. You know, you, it's like you take the, the same right surface, level. The right condition. Yeah, yeah. you play yeah. the same level in somewhere else and then maybe you have a good you result. Know, there's, you know? I, I feel like this week it seems like it's playing almost like clay court style like right that ball is going up and down and like you everyone's kind of throwing that ball into that loop up and down it's just gonna be like not you not you today i'm i'm gonna try not to Yo, the first five minutes there's nothing up above my knees like, <laughs> back i'm just going skidding. straight this way side spin back i going this but, way yeah but it's, it's strict you don't know if like it really in the match how effective that's going to be right like if, if it's actually gonna do any damage so you have to be like kind of hypersensitive to 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 Again, what's kind of keeping you at least like neutral on the point. Mm -hmm. And sometimes it might have to be like, you know, kind of having to go a little bit more. But sometimes it might, you know, like with <laughs> a good example is like we would watch Marcos play Bautista Ogut. And the better Marcos hit, the better Bautista hit every time. Marcos is hitting amazing and Bautista was just like, pff, 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 pff. and he just takes Marcos out every time. Just because Marcos almost plays too clean, mm -hmm. but every time you would watch him play, like he, Mark was like almost didn't wasn't even thinking about it, but he would play like a kind of worse shot, a worse ball. Then he would kind of like be able to get ahead, mm -hmm. you know, and and so like, but he didn't have like that sensitive sensitivity to notice that and to maybe like understand like oh maybe if I play a little bit like shorter and worse like I'll, I'll get some some results out mm -hmm. of this right, so. Um, yeah, it's like it's a tricky, it's a tricky thing, and I, I, I think just in general, at the end of the day, like, I feel like there's always going to be a side that we are not as comfortable yeah. in, and we just kind of have to. Work you find it. yourself like mentally training your forehand during a match, or you, yeah, too, past that? too much. It's still, yeah. mm -hmm. I was tell I was telling myself last week that I didn't want to do any swings because I have the the just like. In between points, you're always like swinging. Yeah. And I was like, stop swinging. Stop like, stop swinging. Just like, you know what I mean? Go to the next point. <laughs> go to the next yeah. point. Yeah. But it, I think, um, yeah, I, I do think about it a lot. Like, I, I'm always like, it, it's a, I'm not so worried about like, I don't know about you guys, but like for me, it's feeling. I feel like I'm way too in tune with my feelings playing. Like, mm -hmm. oh, this feels right. This feels right. It's not necessarily how it looks, but it's like, yeah. it's the, What's the ball doing? Yeah. It's the feeling right like yeah. is that what, do, almost like do you do you feel the racket the entire time or is that a point where you almost like lose where the racket it's kind mm -hmm. of like a golf swing it's yeah. like you don't want the feeling to then change the way you're actually swinging at the ball because yeah. probably you're swinging at it the same way as you were yesterday but yeah. it feels different and then you try to change <laughs> something and then you actually you know exactly and then you mistake. actually make a a a, a a, a yeah, change that change. is not gonna have yeah. it's not gonna be natural right exactly. what what it feels what feels natural? What feels like easy? What's what yeah. what you know? What targets feel easy? What what shots feel easy? And and then then again, that still allow you to to you know get ahead in the yeah. point. I mean, you watch, you know, again from the experience. I mean, I've, I had the great experience of coaching Marcos against Medvedev and on Rod Laver Arena, and it took him a while to get a game. You know, and it was kind of like <laughs> yeah, the Djokovic Man Arena. Team. Yeah, and it, it was just kind of like man, like you're always like you think you're in the point but he's just doing exactly what he wants you to do the entire time and that's kind of the the more you watch those guys like the more you see that the more you see how like they make the match get played the way they want to play 
and they can control that so well. They're not changing anything. They're not like, they, yeah, there's stats and like here's maybe where this guy struggles a bit more. But in general, there's a there's a level of, of self-confidence on, on what they do, even if it's weird. Like Daniel is so weird. Everything he does is so weird and unorthodox, but he believes it like crazy. But which one comes first, right? Your ability to do it or, or, your, or the belief. And it's the eternal struggle, I yeah. think.